Hi, I'm Casey with Command Light, and today I'm going to be showing you how to replace an FRC Spectra LED on a Command Light. The tools you're going to need for this are a number two Phillips screwdriver, a half inch wrench, a 7 16 wrench, some crimpers, wire cutters, wire strippers, and some narrow spade or fork connectors. You'll need a new LED. You'll also need the gasket that comes with the LED. To start, you're going to need to take out all the screws on the top cover. I've already done that. Then we'll remove that. Next, you'll need to remove the screws in this back cover here that covers the electrical of the, the lamp tree. I've done that as well. Go ahead and remove that. At this point, make sure your power is off and take note of how everything is wired inside here. Um, today we're going to be changing out our middle bank right lamp. Um, so see where those wires are coming from in here. That's going to be uh, middle bank is red and gray in here, so we'll be removing uh, the spade connectors on here that are red and gray. So you'll want to take your number two Phillips screwdriver and uh, loosen the screws on your red and gray. You'll take those wires off. That lamp, these two wires are wired together. You've got black and red as your power and your white as your neutral. Um, all the grounds on all three of these lamps are going to be tied together so you'll want to loosen the screw on this last green ground stud here. Take that off. Then you'll take some wire cutters and cut the fork connectors off. The next step is to remove the lamp. You'll have to loosen the two bolts inside the lamp tree here. Once you get those two bolts removed, go ahead and pull the wires through the lamp tree. At this point, you'll need to remove the arm off of the fixture. You can use your 7 16 wrench to remove these quarter 20 bolts. You'll then take the wires out of the arm. It's important that if one of these fixtures is being replaced at no charge, covered under our warranty, that you send the old fixture back to us. If you don't send the old fixture back to us, then you will get charged for the new fixture. On your new LED, the first step is to put the gasket on the lamp, on the bottom of the lamp, where it's going to mount to the arm, the command light arm.
slide the wires through the gasket. Once you've got the gasket stuck on there, you can then feed the wires through the hole in the top of the arm. Get those wires through the end hole there. Oops. Let's see. Line the holes up on the fixture and put the quarter 20 bolts back in. Be careful on this side when you're putting your bolt in to make sure you're not going to crush any of the wires inside the arm. Tighten those back down. Then you'll need to feed the wires down the lamp tree and back into the electrical box on the back side of the lamp tree. Also, if you have a pick or a hook at this point, you could use that to pull your wires through the hole. Pull your wires all the way through. Make sure that the wires are all inside the arm when you attach this and that none of these wires are getting crushed. Go ahead and tighten these back down. Those bolts nice and tight. Then you will need to wire your new lamp in. These wires here are already cut to length. If you've got a lamp with full length wires, you'll need to cut them down a bit. First start with your greens. Strip them back about half an inch. Twist all three green wires together. And then crimp your fork connector onto all three green wires. That will go down to the end green on the TRW strip. Make sure to get this other green on there. Tighten that screw down. And 
Then we will do the two whites, which are your neutrals. Again, strip them about half an inch long. Twist them together. And crimp a fork onto those. Like I said before, the middle bank commons will go to gray. Upper bank commons go to white. Lower bank commons go to yellow. Uh, the lamp that we're doing here is a middle bank, so that's gonna go to red. The hot will go to red. The upper bank hots will go to black, and the lower bank hots will go to blue. So now that we're going to wire in our hots, let's strip this black and red wire. On the standard Spectra fixtures, you're only going to have three wires. You're going to have a black, a white, and a green. Black will go to black, red, or blue. Those are your hots. And then the white will go to your commons, which are white, gray, and yellow. Crimp this last fork connector on. Middle bank goes to red. Tighten that screw down. Make sure all the wires are tucked in nice and neat. Then you can replace this back cover here Make sure it goes on correctly. Make sure you get your screws in nice and tight on this. This does have this plunger here, which does activate the nest sensor. So that needs to be positioned on there correctly. So it hits the sensor underneath it. Tighten that down, get the screws back in that. Put your top dust cover back on. Tighten all these screws back down and your lamp has been replaced. If you have any questions, you can give us a call or visit our website. This has been Casey with Command Light. Thanks for watching.